All right, guys, very different topic today. I want to share uh, with you what to do with the Briggs & Stratton engine, which has a broken compression release valve. If you normally have a full battery, but the engine doesn't crank or it doesn't turn, it may actually be a broken uh, compression release. And first of all, you check your battery, if the battery is good. And this happens. Engine turns and then stops. There is a chance there is a broken compression relief valve. To fix that, you actually, to repair this, you actually have to break open the entire engine, which where I live the mechanics cannot do, they will destroy the engine for you. Or you can do it, but I don't really want to spend time getting dirty doing that sort of things. So there is a quick way to do this and I will demonstrate it now. Open up the air intake, remove the air filter like that. And what we're going to do now is to deblock the air intake and that, that way we don't have any compression of air inside the engine until the engine actually starts turning. And once it starts turning, the revolution is up. I can, re I can unblock here and let the actually engine, the revolution or the momentum of the engine will actually be able to compress it without the relief well. So let me show you that. I have here a piece of rubber. Anything will do to block air tight, to block the intake. I start and once this engine starts to turn, I let it go. 